It is a threatening call hundreds of people across the metro just received, and it's causing many people to think they are in trouble with the feds. The reason that this call is to inform you that IRS is filing lawsuits against you. With that call, and many like that call, are complete scams. New at 10 o'clock, 41 Action News reporter Lexi Souter found out why now is prime time for scammers. So before this matter goes to federal going house, or before you get arrested, you're hearing a voice message Kansas City resident Janet Markham received Tuesday from a man threatening to arrest her if she didn't pay up. I got a phone call uh, from someone saying they were the IRS and they were going to sue me. Then, a couple hours later, the reason that this call is to inform you that the IRS is filing lawsuits against oh. you. Another you scammer with a different voice Please and a different number. Please call immediately on our department number 812-239. I did call them. And it was very unprofessional, a lot of noise. We called both numbers too, but we got no answer. Today is whenever we started getting dozens of calls. At least 50 people have reported the scammers to the Better Business Bureau. Spokesperson Aaron Reese says post tax day is the prime time for IRS scams. If they start demanding money immediately, if you've never heard of it before, like you've never heard of a debt that you owed, because the IRS is always going to contact you by mail first. Fortunately, Janet didn't fall for the calls. Actually, I work for the IRS. She knew better, but knows others may not. I knew that we don't call and say things like this at all. If you have received one of these calls and you want to report it, or if you want to check your status with the IRS to make sure you do not owe any money, we've simplified that process for you. We put it all, including the direct lines to the IRS, on our website at KSHB.com. Lexi Suter, 41 Action News.